guys do not underestimate the power of beauty and presentation you cannot change your life without changing your bad habits guys i've come to realize that the duration or the length of a particular friendship does not really determine the quality of that friendship guys if you can give value you can actually make money what's up guys so welcome back to my youtube channel guys today we are literally back with a very juicy topic guys today i'm literally gonna have like a chit chat about the five things i'm actually doing right now to put my life together and i feel it's time i literally share this because i've been getting a lot of persons reach out to me about their lifestyle how to do a revamp in their life how to literally spring clean their life how to literally level up their life and i feel it's literally time i share a little bit of the things i'm doing right now to literally fix my life and put my life together and guys the very first disclaimer my life is literally not perfect so guys this tip i'm literally going to share in this video are the things that i've been doing recently that i feel every young person should actually be trying right now and guys without wasting any more time let us literally jump straight into this video guys the very first thing i've been doing in my life lately and i feel this is literally something that every young person should be doing right now and i literally talk about this i think in my last video guys it's budgeting guys i don't think i can really emphasize this enough learning how to budget your finances is actually one important way to fix your life especially if you are so eager about self-development if you are eager about growing and becoming the best version of yourself you cannot keep living your life like you're living it for someone else i think i came to a realization of my life that ah i really don't want to wake up one morning at 30 or at 40 and realize that i really don't really know how my money like is being spent i don't know um where my money is going to i really don't know how to track my finances i really had to make that intentional decision that right now at this phase of my life i really need to learn about budgeting i need to know how to budget my money i need to know how to track my finances guys that is literally one of the first thing you have to do if you want to literally fix your life put your life together you need to get your finances on track guys you have to learn how to budget your money now guys because i am still a student i have literally tried my best to track my finances in a way that it really is so automated guys my transportation in school is already fixed i already have a budget for that every single month my grocery list every single thing i need to do i feel this is something every single person needs to do like you can't keep living your life like you are living it in one movie like this is you you are the main character of your movie you need to know how to budget your finances you need to know how to handle money you need to know how to grow your finances guys if you really want to become the best version of yourself budgeting and finance tracking is actually the first step for you to actually level up guys guys the second thing i am literally doing right now to fix my life is to fix my finances guys i don't think you can literally fix your life and put your life together if your finances is not on track you need to exit your broke girl era guys i don't really think i can emphasize it enough i just got to a point in my life where i knew that i really can't keep living like this and i'm literally not where i need to be now like i'm literally not swimming in wealth totally now but i can confidently say that right now i am much better than before and that is a decision that i made that i really need to fix my finances like guys fixing your finances is actually very very important and I don't care about any excuse you are going to give. Like, this is 2024. You can literally fix your finances. You can literally make money online in so many ways, guys. If you are a lady, if you are a guy, there are literally tons of ways you can actually make money. Every single thing in this life right now is value. If you can give value, you can actually make money. I believe that there's literally nobody in this planet Earth that really do not have something in particular knowledge or a particular idea that people will be willing to pay for. So guys, you just have to discover that thing that you know that you can do very well. Monetize it and get people to pay for it. Like the money you are literally looking for is in the pocket of people working for me every single day. So you can actually devise a means sell value to people and actually get money in return and whether you're selling a physical product or maybe you are selling digital products online you're rendering a service you literally have to make the decision to fix your finances if you really want to start fixing your life so guys the third thing i have been doing to fix my life to level up my life to literally put my life all together has been to eliminate 
toxic friendship guys like i've come to realize that the duration or the length of a particular friendship does not really determine the quality of that friendship guys i have been learning to eliminate toxic friendship guys i have been learning to determine the kind of people i allow in my sphere the kind of people i literally give my energies to the kind of people i hang out with i think friendship is actually one important way to fix your life because the kind of friends you have reflect the kind of person you are at this point in my life i literally told myself i have to fix my friendship my circle i needed to eliminate toxic friendship like i became really selective of the kind of people i allow into my circle the kind of people that are present in my sphere i got intentional about eliminating toxic friendship guys you cannot be my friend if you enjoy gossip you cannot be my friend if you literally do not have a growth mindset i feel people of young age everybody literally right now should be so like intentional about the people they allow in their space toxic friendship is literally not my thing like it literally got to a point in my life where i knew that fixing my life and putting my life together has to do with the company i keep the kind of people i allow into my life the kind of people i share my energy with because people see you and they see your friends so what are your friends literally reflecting about you like that is something you need to ponder about today what are your friends reflecting about you that is something i had to get intentional about one thing a lot of people need to know guys because you are cosmates with a particular person because you guys attend school together or you take classes together that doesn't mean that automatically you guys are friends learn to intentionally pick your friend next one year i am really getting intentional about building a very healthy network and building a healthy network means i have to eliminate the toxic ones like i really do not want any kind of friend that is not adding anything to my life anymore guys i want to get very intentional about the kind of friends i keep because I am getting older and I really don't want to wake up one morning at 30 and realize that I did not build healthy friendship. I don't want friends that are very um, envious of me or the little achievements I, I have. I want people that really match my vibe, vibes on vibe. I want friends with people that are really intentional about their growth, people that want the best for themselves. And I see you, I see how eager you are for a growth mindset. And I'm also challenged, I'm also enthusiastic, and I'm also very set up to become the best version of myself i think that is one thing i'm really working on right now to fix my life like guys i have been getting intentional about my friendship like i'm eliminating any toxic friendship if you really bully people if you don't know how to talk to people you don't have good communication skill you don't have a growth mindset i am too grown to be having friends that do not reflect a perfect aura of the kind of person i want to become in future so guys that's literally something i've been working on for this year and i'm feeling very comfortable with it it might get really lonely but i am getting intentional about eliminating toxic friends even if the price i have to pay is not having people around me for now and create the healthy friendship i deserve that is literally what i have to do this is your sign to eliminate toxic friendship guys do not make friends or keep friends that do not represent the image of the person you want to become in future so guys we are still talking so guys the fourth thing i have been doing to really put my life together to level up is to get very intentional with your routines and guys when it comes to routines you have to remember that it is progress over perfection do not try to be perfect i think that was the mistake i was doing at the early stage of creating routines for myself i was striving to be perfect instead of taking the little steps every day and just grow progressively if you really want to stay productive you need to understand that it's not a day job get intentional about taking little steps every single day that is literally what stirs you and pushes you forward before now i used to think perfection was the way i will literally just write like 15 or 20 things i want to do in a day and guess what guys i would not achieve anyone because i was seeking perfection instead of progress when it comes to fixing your life and you want to get intentional about your routines start with the little things start planning your day start with your weekly schedules start having a particular total list for every single day and in your total list make it as simple as possible like start with three tasks in a particular day start with two tasks if you have an online course or online skill you are trying to learn start with scheduling every single um topic you want to learn take it one step at a time stop trying to be perfect guys you are literally going to be burnt out you're literally going to find it so tiring and frustrating if you're trying to be perfect just 
take it one day at a time guys we really can't talk about routines organizing your life creating automated schedules without talking about your space i really feel every single person should have an organized space for you to be productive on purpose for you to have a very good routine for you to be able to stay productive your space has to reflect who you are your space needs to connect with you i feel a lot of people want to really get productive but their environment would literally limit them and that is something you need to get intentional about your space having a very clean space guys is very very important if you're trying to fix your life mentally your space should be able to connect with you emotionally your space needs to connect with you if i'm in a very disorganized and dirty environment I cannot stay productive so if you really want to fix your life fix your routines you need to literally get intentional about your space invest in your space make your space as beautiful as possible if your space is messy you would not be in the right state of mind to become productive to even have a very good routine so guys you cannot be staying in a zoo and expect your mind to literally be very effective so you need to learn how to declutter your space make your space as relatable to you as possible so guys the fifth and final thing i have been doing lately to literally put my life off together has been to intentionally change my bad habits guys i got intentional about changing my bad habits you cannot want to fix your life or level up without making a decision to change your bad habits literally used to say this in a lot of my video i used to be the very scattered closet girly but i decided and got intentional about fixing my bad habits guys if you really want to fix your life you need to start with those bad unhealthy habits that you do have like guys you cannot be saying at this age that um one person is the reason or giving excuses for a particular mouth order that you have or a particular body order get intentional about fixing your bad habits if you are the kind of person that you find it difficult to arrange your closet like me for the longest i can remember i used to be the very scattered closet girly but when i started to stay alone i decided to change my bad habits because i started seeing my bad habits for myself so i would literally recommend any young person growing up to at least stay alone at least once in your lifetime like get to know yourself on a certain level i started to study myself know my bad habits know some of the things some of the unhealthy habits that i needed to change and got intentional about changing my bad habits you cannot change your life without changing your bad habits guys i feel every single person knows the kind of bad habits they have but they are just living in denial or even if you think you don't know i think you should get comfortable with asking people asking your friends what are the things that you think i'm doing that is wrong get people to literally tell you their mind their honest opinion about your lifestyle and when they tell you about the things you are doing wrong don't get defensive guys literally write them down and get intentional about fixing it guys that is literally how you fix your life i think i have to talk about one last thing and that is having a very good self-care ritual guys do not underestimate the power of beauty and presentation it is very important that you get intentional about tending to yourself taking good care of yourself that is literally one way you can fix your life guys you cannot fix your life and you are still looking ugly get intentional about tending to your beauty do not go out looking unpolished guys take good care of your beauty take good care of yourself like literally ensure that you are wearing the right clothes you are not wearing rumpled clothes out there you need to literally present yourself presentable now before people will actually want to listen to you they want to see who you are first of all they want to see your presentation and that is something every young person every lady every guy you have to work on guys get intentional about tending to your beauty having good self-care rituals taking good care of yourself if you really want to fit your life and these are the five things i've been doing for the past how many months and i've been getting intentional about it and guys my life has literally changed guys if you literally found this video helpful i want you to literally click the subscribe button because it encourages me to make more educative and more informative content like this and guys thank you so much for watching this video and i will be seeing you guys in my next video bye guys